In this video, I will tell you step by step how to bypass FRP on Redmi Note 11 Pro 5G phones. Check out these steps carefully. You should compare the steps on your phone with the steps in the video and proceed. Once you reach this stage, you need to connect the phone to Wi-Fi. Enter the Wi-Fi password and click connect. After connecting to Wi-Fi, proceed. At this stage, since you don't know the phone's password, click Use Google Account instead. In this step, you need to add back the Gmail account used on the phone. If you don't remember Gmail, you will have to do FRP bypass. Click on Add Network button. OK, enter www.youtube.com here. Click in here. Find Gmail, then press Gmail and enter it. Click on Notification. Select Additional Settings in the app. Click on here. Click on Help and Feedback. Select Delete or Disable Apps on Android. Click like this. Click on this. And then search settings. Click open. This phone comes with Android 11 and MIUI 13. Take care of the following settings and follow them step by step. I will try to add a new password. OK, I will add a new password. Note this method is also not convenient. Let's continue in another way. Click on Additional Settings. Click on Accessibility. Select Accessibility menu and then switch on. OK, go back to the next steps. OK, stop here. Select Show System. At this time, all the applications on the phone will appear. Find Android Setup. Click on Force Stop. And then find another apps. Find Google Play service and enter. Disable Google Play service and then force stop. OK after everything is done. Make sure to do the same as in the video.
at this stage, you need to be patient and careful. Follow the instructions in the video carefully. Click on Enable. OK, just press the back key. If you skip each of these steps, the FRP bypass process is completed successfully. OK now FRP bypass on Redmi Note 11 Pro 5G is finished. Thanks for watching till the end. Let's meet again in the next videos.